Hello, Gemini. Thank you so much for tuning in. This is going to be another general reading to see who or what is coming towards you in love. Um, the messages could be interchangeable or vice versa. So please feel free to switch them up however you need to. Um, what else? What else I got to shave? Oh, yeah. This could be something happening now in the near future or the future. Okay. So, you know, it's timeless, my loves. It's timeless. So you could definitely be dealing with a Scorpio. So let's see what is going on in this love thing. Maybe a Pisces. Any fire sign. All right, spirit. Who or what is coming towards the Gemini collective in life, please? Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, North Node, South Node, and Antarctica. You know, Alaska, all that shit. If you do watch that. All right. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Help me to connect to their higher self spirit. Thank you so much. Could be done with any other air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Who or what's coming towards Gemini and love spirit? Gemini. Those born under the Gemini collective. Who or what collective? <laughs> Star sign. Sorry, guys. Who is coming towards Gemini and love? Okay. Two more cards for Gemini, please. Who or what's coming towards Gemini and love? Gemini. Ooh, Gemini. Okay, yeah, definitely could be Scorpio you're dealing with. All right, I have Pisces here, so hang in. What came out next? Ooh, the Hermit. The Ten of Pentacles. The King of Wands in the reverse. Ooh, death in the reverse. Four of Swords in the reverse. Ooh, Gemini, okay. So, what I'm seeing here is that, um, actually, I'm seeing two things here. What I'm picking up primarily is that this could have been someone that you were in a long-term relationship with, okay? Or this could be someone that you've seen that potential with. It's either one. This could be someone that you were married to. Maybe this fucking person is married, and you could be waiting for this person to let something go, let some, you know, leave someone so that you guys can be together could be that situation because you know the hangman is definitely okay pause stop something needs to be done here okay there's there especially when it's next to the hermit this person may maybe this person stopped talking to you or they may have um went ghost or maybe you went ghost on this person but i'm just feeling like someone needed to kind of um disconnect in order to maybe fix something get something straightened out or figured out okay yeah because someone's situation someone needs to get out of a situation so that you guys can be together but what i'm also picking up is that if this is someone that you were with um this is someone who is who clearly has not let you go um and they're not going to let you go that easy because the king of wands in the reverse I mean, this is a player from the Himalayas. <laughs> well, not for all of you, right? But the King of Wands in reverse is someone who definitely has control issues. This is someone who is very dominating, um, controlling, possessive. Okay, this could be an ex that is just not going to let you go that easily. Period. Period. So, let's explore further, Gemini, to see to get more information here if you are waiting on somebody to leave a situation maybe they're in a karmic situation and their person is fucking toxic as hell and controlling and all that extra stuff okay but there's a family situation here for sure don't even have to be family but there's a stable situation here right that someone's dealing with you or your person so let's clarify the hangman here please for what's coming towards Gemini and love spirit. Why is the hangman here? Why is the hangman here? Okay. See, four swords again, waiting, burden. Things are not moving. Mm. Yeah, I feel like this situation is a burden. I feel like this situation is a burden. Um, 
the main situation that I'm picking up here, like I said, it could be two scenarios. This is general reading. But I really do feel like someone could be waiting on an answer from someone or waiting for progress to be made. You're waiting for something to come of the connection and you're getting very impatient or someone's getting very impatient here. Just want a new beginning already. Okay. Some of you, um, you know, you could be in the situation you're already involved and maybe you want to be with someone else, right? That could also be possible. And the cross watchers watching is like, hell yeah, I want my motherfucking Gemini. So let's clarify the, the hermit, please. What is this hermit energy about for a Gemini spirit? Who or what's coming towards them in, in love? Why is the hermit here for Gemini, please? Why is the hermit here for Gemini? Hmm, hermit again, bro. <laughs> the hermit again that's telling that is telling death in the reverse again yeah see somebody needs to um somebody there someone is uh not going through with some sort of transformation some type of transition there needs to be a change here but someone is resisting it for whatever reason why is the ten of pentacles here please a gemini for what's coming towards Gemini in love. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? See? Yeah. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's almost like someone's in a dysfunctional relationship. Or someone's, yeah. It's a dysfunctional relationship. That's what I'm seeing. I knew it. The lovers here as well. Someone needs to make a decision or choice. Someone's going crazy. Nine of Swords in reverse because I feel like they really want to be with someone else. Why is the King of Wands here? What is this King of this fucked up King of Wands in reverse about? <laughs> Who or what is coming towards Gemini? Why is the King of Wands here in the reverse spirit? Yeah, someone's in something that is just not stable and not built on solid foundations. See, Queen of someone, yeah, someone could be dealing with a partner who is very clingy, jealous, insecure, needy. Um vindictive they could be dealing with someone who's really toxic this could be describing your your ex <laughs> gemini keep in mind why is it uh, why am i saying why okay so you have the three of cups here see yeah it's like a situation that has been stuck someone wants to leave um a situation i'm telling you somebody wants to leave a situation that is absolutely a dead end right that it's a dead-end situation it's not going anywhere someone is like someone has outgrown a relationship and they want new love <laughs> they want new love they want new love is what i'm seeing here gemini yeah i mean shit this could be your partner you could feel that your partner you and your partner is becoming distant and distant and that's what i'm seeing here someone's just in a dysfunctional relationship why is the um the death card here in the reverse please For Gemini. It's like needing to let something go that should have been let go already. Something that is in balance. It's not peaceful. It's not a peaceful situation. Oh God. You know what, Gemini? I feel like the last three, four readings that I've done for you guys, it's it has had karmic written all over it. You could be dealing with a karmic partner. But someone, if who's ever, whoever is in this dysfunctional relationship, clearly, um, there is definitely some deception there. Yeah. Someone definitely isn't being loyal to the to the person that they're with. Okay? And it's a secret. Yeah. Higher friend in reverse. Someone is definitely... Someone wants to do the right thing, which is leave, right? But they could be afraid of this person that they're with because the person is just really um, overbearing, controlling, and um, could be very nasty to them. So... Why is the four of swords here, please? In the reverse. And you may have been separated, Gemini, from your person for a long time now. And you just want to be with them already. Okay, if it's not you in this situation, but they're dealing with a karmic situation. Why is the four of swords here in the reverse? They're dealing with a karmic situation. And this is why they may have not really been um, communicating communicative with you right and you haven't really heard from them 
Seven of Wands, the Queen of Swords, and the Chariot. Yeah. But they do intend to take action here. I do feel that way. They are taking action, Gemini. And they are going to cut something off. Someone's going to cut someone ass the fuck off and move on with their life very soon. Someone needs to get a divorce. I do feel it happening. And I do see happiness at the end of all this. Yeah. Because someone, um, I'm telling you, someone just has feelings for someone else. Knight of Cups here. I feel like this karmic partner, whoever's dealing with that motherfucker, um, is going to have some trouble getting away from them. Okay? But, um, yeah. The past is the past. And someone's through with it. Someone is through with it. Someone is through with it. Let's see. Who or what's coming towards the Gemini Collective and love, please? Show me what I need to see for Gemini. That wasn't supposed to come out. See? Here it is. The clarity, truth, revelation. Yep, here it is. Someone is going to be learning the truth. Whoever is with this crazy partner, this crazy partner is going to learn the truth very soon. For what's coming for Gemini and love. More messages for Gemini, please. More messages for Gemini. 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 Yeah. <clears throat> Palm tree. Stability, security, permanence. Yeah, I feel like... Um, Someone's happiness is just somewhere else. Love. Unconditional love. See? There's love between you and a person. Someone has fell in love with someone else. You have paradise as well. And then you have the snake. Competition. Enemy. Clever. Yeah. Someone is being highly deceptive here to the partner. The grim reaper. The relationship is over. Yeah. Someone is having a hard time understanding that the relationship has run its course and that it's over. Period. I'm not saying it's you, Gemini, but someone, whoever is embodying the King of Wands in reverse is the person that has trouble uh, uh, accepting that it's over. He has control issues. He doesn't like to lose control in the reverse, okay? He's a mess in the reverse, period. And this person is probably chasing the other person, okay? And making it very hard for them to move on with their life. They just can't let him go. Anyway. Thank you so much, Gemini, for tuning in. I love you all very much, and I hope to see you guys back at my channel. Stay safe, and um, namaste. <laughs>